Good morning everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Sumaya. Uh, in this video we are going to learn adding textures to our Dialux model. If you are visiting my channel for the first time, I would request you to watch my previous tutorials of making model and placing those in windows. Let's get started. For adding materials, we have tool called materials you can find it here click on the tool so basically for adding any color or any material we have three options so let's see first one as create color material under create color material when you click on create color material you can see here custom scale of color appears so you can select it by just picking any color so if you check on advanced properties under advanced properties you have metallic painted and transparent so whatever the material you are applying you can specify here what kind of material it is is it metallic painted or transparent next under this material type there are two readings of reflection factor and reflective coating so for this color it's showing reflection factor as 60 percent basically reflection factor it is a ratio of luminous flux reflected by a body to the luminous flux received by the body if i want to explain you in general say this color has a reflection factor of 60 percent means it can reflect back 60 percent of the light what it is getting and it will observe remaining 40% of the light. I hope you have understood it. So this is how you create color material and apply it. Even you can replace it or let's make it little lighter color and make it painted and you can replace it. If you replace the material, what happens is all the material of the similar color will be replaced this is one option of creating color material and replacing it the other option is of catalogs here you can get catalogs of the dialogs color catalog and material catalog let's select first color catalog under color catalog you have some specific range of colors under each color you have the shades of the same see in yellow these are the shades available you can check out any color say green or gray we let's select any color mm, let me select this one so it says reflection factor is 59 percent it means it is going to reflect back 59 percent of the light apply it and you can apply it or you can replace the material same way you can do do it for the doors and windows let's make our doors and windows black in color you can make it replace material okay so this is how you apply material to doors and windows let's apply some material to the floor select for this one we are going to choose material catalog under material catalog you have various materials for outdoor and indoor so let's check something in indoor in indoor you have subgroups of ceiling window furniture doors and walls so uh, so in floor we have this many options let's select something um, I think this will work apply and you can apply the material or you can replace it let's add some textures to the door in the material catalog under doors you can get door textures but here in my for my project I need some door with black in color so what I can do is I can search in the Google 
download the image and add it so let's see how we are going to do it go to google black door texture Okay, I will select this one, save the image, I will save it on desktop as door, save it, okay, and let's go back to our dialogs file, you can click on create texture material and select your texture from where you have saved it, so my file is here, so you can see my door is applied and it has a reflection factor of only 4% you can increase it or decrease it or you can change the type also for now let me keep it as metallic only and I'm going to pick this one and apply so now if you see my texture is not properly applied for that one what I'm going to do is click on the texture and you can see a scale appears from one point where you want to increase it click the point and extend it now the second point you can decrease it so yes you can see how nicely my texture is applied for the next one what you can do is pick my now you can see your size and you can just apply it where you want and if it is small you can adjust it similarly I'm going to add textures to all my doors so I have finished applying textures to all my doors you can see here let's do the third option again of importing the texture file for that one let's select any file from the google let me select this time wood paneling texture and let me select this image make sure your image does not have any watermark Go back to your dialogs file, create texture material, select the file, open it and the texture appears. So now let's apply texture for this wall. So you can see how neat it looks. So this is how we apply textures to our dialogs file. So this is it guys, if you like this video give it a thumbs up and stay tuned to explore more in dialogues with me. Do not forget to subscribe my channel and if you have any doubts regarding any of the options in the dialogues, just let me know in the comments. Thank you.